Hey folks, Randy Go, Trout Magnum Man with you here today. Today, folks, got a little quick video of me battling a 17 inch hybrid on a Shoreluck Limited Ultralight 6 foot 8 rod by Mega Bass. I have not fished this rod in, uh, I, think I, I think it's been seven years since I had it out fishing. It's been a long time. It's been a long time. It's definitely not a bluegill and crappie rod. It's just too much rod for that. It's an absolutely gorgeous rod. It's a beautiful rod. Uh, but it's not for pan fishing crappie. I had to finish out today uh, fishing with this rod, uh, catching crappie because I broke the other rod. Uh, but it's just not, I mean, you know, I had fun, but it's not, it, you don't want to get one of these rods for, for pan fish. That's a fact. But anyway, uh, this uh, this hybrid sure tested rod. I was using the Veribus, uh Infinity PE times eight and the uh, point two. Uh, which is 5.4 pound test, had a two pound uh, test section of fluorocarbon leader on there. And I mean, this fish uh, gave me all I wanted. Uh, it, it was nice to hook into that fish and land it. Uh, I'll be putting the uh, Mega Bass Shore Luck Limited back in its pouch and putting it up. Uh, it, it, it'll do fine for white bass. Uh, but you know, of course this rod is, I don't know exactly when this rod came out. I, I think I know I've had the rod for seven years. I think something like that. Maybe long. I'm not sure. I know I've had it for seven years. And uh, I got to tell you, you know, I'm, don't don't misunderstand me. It's it's a great rod uh, if you want to catch some white bass, uh, maybe some larger type fish, uh, maybe some Kentucky bass. Uh, if you want to use some nylon line on it, or even the uh, Veribus uh, PE line would work with that. But I'm going to tell you. Uh, you know, I've been fishing newer rods here in the past few years. Uh, the uh, uh, Abu Garcia Real Finesse Series, the uh, uh, Abu Garcia Diplomatic Stream uh, Trout Rods, the Tenru Luna Kia, uh, and of course, a couple of others there. But I'm impressed by how far they've come with blank technology. Uh, the Shorelock Limited, uh, I missed a lot of bluegill. Uh, I missed more fish fishing the Shore Duck Limited yesterday than I've missed in the past three or four years combined. I mean, it was like, you know, it, that rod is just not set up uh, to really, uh, for smaller fish. I mean, of course it's designed for small fish, it's designed for horse mackerel, but that just goes to show you how far blank technology has come. The blanks in the uh, uh, Abu Garcia Eradicator Real Finesse Series, far superior to the blank in this uh, seven-year-old Mega Bass Shore Luck Limited, far superior. Uh, I mean, uh, I, you know, it, it takes you going back to fish some of these older rods to really find out just 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 how far the blank technology has come. And that makes you wonder, well, just how far is it gonna go? And I guess it's just gonna continue to get better and better as each year goes by. But anyway, folks, hope you enjoy the uh, battle uh, that I'm doing with this hybrid. Uh, it certainly uh, tested my skills. Uh, also had to have some luck to get this fish in. Uh, I tell people that all the time. If you're, you, you're fishing an ultralight tackle and you're hooking in these bigger fish, you got to have some skills, but you got to have some luck or you ain't going to get them in. It's just that simple. So anyway, folks, hope all of you are well. Hope all of you are out able to fish. It's beautiful weather here in Tennessee. Hope things are going well for you. Hope you're safe. So until next time, sort up them all, and life is good. That guy fishing for crappie, we wore out every steak bed from here half a mile down. Yep. But you don't know that until you, I mean, no, you know. you don't, no. That's the thing about it, you know, you gotta. Here we go, here we go. Good fish here. This ain't no crappie. This ain't no crappie. I think this is Mr. White Bass. I'm not sure what he is. I'm gonna need your help here, son. Yeah, well, let me get this guy in first. Oh, my son got on a big crappie and I don't know what I got. We got fish going around everywhere here. Yeah, get, get that back in the water and get this, this thing. I don't know. Well, I don't know what we got here. I don't know what I got here. This might be a hybrid. I, I don't. I don't know what he is. I don't have a clue what he is. I 
I know he don't want to come to the net. I know that. Shoot, fire. What have I got here, folks? What have I got here? That gun. I don't know what I got here. What have I got? That gun. He's fighting. Whatever he is, he's fighting. For sure. Oh, that's a, what is that, a big hybrid? Looks or, like it. It's a, it looks like a hybrid. It looks like a hybrid to me, folks, on the, on the ultralight here. Yes, sir. This joker is flat cutting up now. Oh, yeah, 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 good hybrid, good hybrid. Get him, get him, son. Come on, get up here and get him. Get up here and get him. All right, all right, son. Yes, sir. Shoot fire, folks. Wow. That's a nice hybrid on ultralight tackle, folks, and I'm here to tell you. Yes, sir. Shoot fire. That's a nice hybrid on ultralight tackle. All right. Gonna get a measurement on this hybrid, folks. I don't have a scale. I'm gonna keep a scale. That's a 17-inch that's a hybrid. I don't know how good you can see it there. Get out of this. That's a 17-inch hybrid. There it is, folks. That's a, that's a gorgeous fish. On ultralight tackle? Yes, sir. Come on, get in there. All right, all right.